We need to talk. <sighs> Damn right. Lots for me to explain. But not here. The night's got ears. We can have our talk in your head. You have a room there, right? How do you know about that? I'm your grandfather. <laughs> what don't I know? about my mind place? How is that possible? We all have the power. Find the truth. Damn right I do. Odin already told you you're a seer. You can gaze into their heads, see the truth. See past the lies. Past this bullshit horror story. Us Andersons aren't bound by it. You can fight it. Don't be the story. Make the story. It's true. I am a seer. I have a power. My mind place is more than I thought it was. This isn't my intuition. I'm seeing their thoughts. Is this why I know the truth about Logan? While everyone else forgot? You said you were my grandfather. If that's true, why wasn't I told about you? You were part of our fucked up family. Way before this horror story. I was a shitty fucking dad to Freya. Your mom didn't deserve that. Not one bit. Things were said and done. Not a day goes by I haven't regretted it. But that fucking father of yours didn't make things any easier. I know Freya is gone. So I need to apologize to you. I am sorry, Saga. I can see he's sorry. Mom said she didn't want anything to do with my grandfather. And that my father died before I could remember. It all matches. Tor and Odin are part of my family. You said you were a shitty father to my mom. Is that why she left? Freya never looked back. My girl was strong. Freya always thought our powers had a dangerous side. Odin and me did fuck with things that should not have been fucked with. Your mom had common sense. She raised you right. Kept you safe. I'm not surprised she didn't tell you about the Anderson power. She was always protecting me. Whenever I told my mom about my mind place, she called it make-believe. I wish she'd been more honest with me. At least towards the end. Mom wouldn't talk about my father. You knew him? Some doors are better left closed. Your dad was a complicated bastard. Always thinking too many steps ahead. That's not how we work. There was trouble, and then he was gone. I didn't handle it well. Freya didn't want anything to do with me after that. I can't blame her. I never knew my dad or my mom's family. So many broken relationships in my past. I won't lose mine. With Logan. With David. I won't stop until they're safe. I have the clicker. Can I use it to save my daughter? An app? Get your guitar roaring and your drums crashing. Blow reality's eardrums. Just the light switch isn't enough. It's Tom's story we're dealing with, so he's gotta be the one to rewrite it. 
After that's done, he can flick that switch to bring the whole thing home, baby. I can't use the clicker without Wake. Tom. Meaning Wake. He needs to rewrite the story first. I can't stop the horror story without him. Wake wrote Logan into the story. He had no right to use her like this. There is still time to make him fix it. I won't give him a choice. The way Tor behaved? I'm surprised my mom hung around for as long as she did. But he is genuinely sorry. Wake needs to be the one to rewrite the ending. And I'll need to keep an eye on him. Nope. Overlaps require pieces of art to enter. Is that because of the dark places focus on art? Thanks for telling me this, Tor. I need to go find Wake to stop this. The old gods of Asgard will be ready to help. Me and my bro will bring the rock when you need it. Remember, your daughter is a lie. Just kept from you by this bullshit horror story. I needed to hear that. Thanks, Grandpa. Don't worry about me, kiddo. I'll drag my sorry ass over to Odin. A few shots of the Anderson's finest will fix us both up. See you soon, Saga. The FBC is holding Wake at the Sheriff's Station. I need to make Agent Estevez understand. They have Wake and I have the Clicker. We have to work together to stop this. Casey, do you read me, Casey? Damn it. Where are you, Casey? He better be okay. Focus, Saga. Get to the station to wake.
next, it's time to make some predictions on what parade floats we'll be seeing at Deer Fest. This year's parade theme is deer, just like every year, so we're not exactly reinventing the wheel here. But first, I need to address something. I know the last couple of shows took a strange turn. With people coming on talking nonsense about certain people passing away. Listen, I know everybody who steps foot in and out of this town. So I'm sure as heck know if Wendy Davis died or went missing. Yeah. You know, they say I'm, I'm confused. I hear them in the hall murmuring about me. Well, Pat's got a rusty ticker, but my head's as clear as those skies are going to be on the opening day of Deer Fest. Somebody's trying to twist this story around, and I don't know quite why. But I'm, I'm here to tell you that everything's going to be okay. Wendy Davis is alive and well. And you can rest easy knowing that Wendy Davis' family beef jerky will be available this Sunday just like it always is. Now, with all this, uh, let's, let's talk about the... Um, uh, what was it we were talking about? Deer. Yes, something deer. Uh, hold on, let me, let me think real quick. Right. So first, I just want to mention that I know the last couple of shows took a strange turn. With people coming on talking nonsense about certain people passing away. Wait, did, did we talk about this already? I think we... No, I, I definitely said this already. It's a great topic. Uh, lined up with... God, I'm so sorry. It's, it's just not coming to me. Perhaps we need to end it here for now. We'll pick this up later. Dear, it had something to do with deer. I know, I wrote it down. Why can't I just read? What was it? Maybe Norman took my notes. Oh, gotta see Norman. Gotta see Norman. <laughs>
There's a rhyme over here. on greener pastures now. More of those rhymes. Another one of those cult boxes.
She wouldn't just wander off and not tell us. Especially after all the weirdness at the lodge. I'm worried, Jules. Well, I'm fucking worried, too. You just had to follow some stupid internet rumors and solve the riddle of Bright Falls. You didn't have to come. It's not my fault we got caught in the middle of an active occurrence. Look, we just need to find Marcy. Good grub you got here. I'm glad to hear it. They're all so soft and sad. I can't get through this. out. Always a good sign. There's Taken inside. Holding cells. Is that where they're keeping Wake? Door is locked, though. Anyone here? I'm here, in the closet. Agent Estevez? Is that you? Anderson? Didn't I tell you to fuck off? Looks like it's a good thing I didn't. Looks like. <laughs> My leg's busted, so I'm gonna need your help. Listen, there is a person out there with you invaded by something that we call the Shadow, and if you a don't... Taken. Yeah, I'll handle it. Clear, Estevez. That leg doesn't look good. <sighs> Feels even worse. But thanks for saving the rest of me. We should talk. What happened here? <laughs> Where to fucking start? <sighs> We came to check out a system alert at Cauldron Lake, but it's worse than we could handle. Real boondoggle. The police, my own agents, most were invaded before we could even react. Have you found my partner, Agent Casey? Yeah, we found him, out in the woods. He had a close encounter with the Shadow, and it did something to him. Is he okay? He's alive. We took him down to the morgue for an examination. Haven't heard anything since the attack. What did the FBC come here to do? 
Bright Falls is the site of a recurring altered world event. The shadow is stronger than we expected. We're low on resources, problems at HQ. But we do have equipment for dealing with the shaded threat. We were just caught off guard before we could set it up. Where is Wake? I know what's going on here. Wake can fix this. Alan Wake is a para-utilitarian. The word's a mouthful, so you know it's serious. We have him locked up in the holding cells per protocol. He's connected to the shadow in some way. Estevez, I need to see Wake. How do I get into the cell block? Okay. <laughs> Protocols don't mean that much at this point anyway. Don't make me regret this, Anderson. Until the power's back on, the door to the holding cells won't open. There's a fuse box downstairs in the basement. Here. I'll need these keys. Back into the morgue, huh? Fantastic. Get the clicker to wake and make him fix his attempt to play God. That's the plan. But the FBC have him. The cell door won't open without power. Do you read me, Anderson? I read you. Have you had our frequency this entire time? Eavesdropping is a big part of the job. But no, I got it from your partner. Anderson, look for a fuse to replace the blown out one in the fuse box. That should get the power going again. Yeah. On it. Another cold stash? You? Anderson? Hold your fire! I'm coming in! Hey, Anderson. Like what I've done with the place? Hmm. Could use a bit more glide. <sighs> Funny. Stay put, Casey. I'll let you know when it's safe. I'm not going anywhere. <clears throat> How? 
how are you holding up? Ah, don't give me that worried look, Anderson. It's just a, it's a flesh wound. <laughs> Gave me a chance to have a, a nice chat about ex-wives with uh, Kieran. Uh, Agent Estevez, I mean. Making new friends, huh? I'm jealous. Are you sure you're okay? Yeah, I'm fine. What's the situation on your end? What happened at the hotel? Wake was telling the truth about the cult being after him. The thing, the dark presence, it's real, too. I saw it. A fucked up monster cloud. Wake tried to warn me. It knocked me out. FBC found me in the woods later. Watery turned out to be a good lead. Found the clicker and the cult. But the horror story is changing reality. Like Wake said it would. Logan, she's, uh... The story claims she died here. But we can stop it. Wait, Saga. What are you, um... Logan is gone. She has been. For a long time. Casey's affected by the horror story, too. I'm fighting for them all now. I'm gonna fix this, Casey. You, Logan, all of it. I just need to get the power back on first. Yeah, give him hell, Anderson. Just remember, some things in life can't be fixed with a light switch. As for the power problem, here. I found a fuse on those poor bastards there. I'll take care of it. I can tell something is wrong. What's happening to Casey? I'm a goner. Swell. A shadow crawling under my skin. In my head. Call my ex. Tell her I'm sorry. Terminal case, Casey. Something is wrong with him. He's hurt worse than he says. He's scared. Anderson, good news, bad news. You can get to the cell block now, but the shaded hostels that were in there are on the loose. Thanks for the heads up. Saga! Fucking FBI, FBC, you government fucks all fucking this up for us! Let us the fuck out! You're the leaders of the cult. You're not going anywhere. Wake will ruin everything. Get rid of him, Saga! You fucking shot me! Typical government stooge. Let me out so I can kill him, that fucker! You come to our town and act like you know what you're dealing with, but you have no fucking idea! Let us out! You can't stop it, none of you can. We can take care of this. We've been preparing for this. Saga, do you have it? You wrote Logan into the story. You told me yourself from the dark place. Listen, Scratch is coming. He's, he's close. He's almost here. He's... My daughter is dead because of you. She's a child. What the fuck is wrong with you? I'm trying to fix this. I will fix this. 
I'll save everyone, but we're running out of time. I need the clicker. I have the clicker. You will fix this. You will save my daughter. Promise me. Yes, I promise. But we're out of time. Hurry! Don't fucking give it to him! He's a fucking monster, Saga! There it is. We've been waiting for you, motherfucker. I'm gonna fucking destroy you! Pretending to be awake. The plan is fucked. Estevez, come in. Scratch is here. How do I stop him? Glad you. Containment unit isn't prepped, but the light array should affect him. Okay. Lights. Got it. be back. What the fuck do we do now? 